when I was a kid, I was a massive Evil Knievel fan. And I was caught jumping everything I could in the backyard. I even got his, his autograph tattooed on my arm. So, you know, it's kind of in the blood. I was blown away as a kid, and I thought, I want to do that. I'm Matt Mingay, and this is my job. So it started all the way back in 1996, and it actually started here at Sydney Motorsport Park. motorbikes, or drift cars, or jump traffic trucks, anything to do with action, I do it. Yeah, so we put our bodies through a lot. I don't crash very often. I do about 250 to 300 shows a year. Probably crash about once every three years. Today was one of those times. Um, there was just a bit of a brain fade and I went straight over the back of the bike. The handlebars have smashed me in the ribs and this morning I found out, yeah, I've got a broken rib. Oh, done like a dinner. Yeah, that felt good, not. Strapped it up and hopefully the pain won't be there, but who cares? The show must go on. Motorsport Park, I uh, came to watch the two French dudes stunt riding on fire blades. Sure enough, two years later, I entered a stunt competition and I won it and I uh, blossomed from there. I threw my job in as a motorcycle mechanic. From the year 1997, I've been stunt riding full time. I entertain the crowd, sort of start off as, so I travel around the whole of Australia and New Zealand and we do everything. I do about 35 to 40 events a year. I've always been a massive advocate of, um, you know, doing it for the fans and that's just one, one other case of it.
some of the things I get told is, oh, you're so lucky you get to do the job you do. I mean, I didn't win the lotto. There's not really any luck involved. I work seven days a week, train hard. You know, we put our bodies through a hell of a lot. a lot of work and a lot of stress to just keep on going and going and keep everyone happy.